Gals pretty. on the basic. Pretty on the go is Shut cute. It's cute. Pretty, pretty gal. Go mode on. I, yeah, yeah. 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 Like, okay, so you don't know me. Yeah, let's <laughs> drive <laughs> Or like oh, micro miss. Like, uh, but Seth. I also feel like we started our podcasts years ago for this very moment. <gasps> What's up, you guys? Welcome back to Gals in the Go podcast. I'm Danielle. I'm Brooke. I'm Alicia. And I'm Remy. Oh! <laughs> Disney Channel crossover episode Pretty Basic X GOTG. Why did I say GOTG? GOTG. Gals on the go. <laughs> Did you guys do PB mostly or like pretty basic? PB, yeah, PB. Yeah. PB. I mean, G-O-T-G. internally we say PB, but I feel like publicly we'll say pretty basic. Pretty on the go, gals pretty. on the basic. <gasps> pretty on the go is Shut cute. Up, it's cute. Oh, pretty, pretty gals. Cute. Oh wait, pretty gals on the go. <laughs> pretty on the go. Pretty pretty basic gals on the go. I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. that's true. Yeah. That's true. Yeah. I was watching your vlog this morning. And you're like, this shirt is pretty basic, and I was like. <gasps> <laughs> that's what we planned that's what we planned i feel like i'm always still saying content baby content oh yeah. my god like it's like it's literally on their mic said. stands <laughs> it's it's it was a good oh. phrase i oh, like yeah. content baby content. don't love that man but like love that man no i mean hope like, he's well. i hope he's doing hope well. He's well no we are so excited to be here in la be here with remy and alicia it's such like you guys are just I don't want, I don't feel saying like big sister, but like you guys really have just been always so kind and supportive of us and like constantly commenting on our stuff and hyping us up in person. And I hope you feel the same from us. Like we love you so much. And Seriously. this is long time coming. Oh, that means the world. So much. Means the world. True, not to get sloppy, oh. but <laughs> this is a swap, you guys. So there's also yeah. going to be an episode on their channel, on their channel. This is like a YouTube collab. Yes. 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 On Pretty Basic. Yeah. And we just recorded that one and it is so fun. Like I just seriously love how it turned out. So we'll have that episode linked down below for you guys but we're so honored to be swapping with the pretty basic gals oh my god no we are honored to be here it, it always feels weird whenever we do because we've done a few swaps mm-hmm. here where the other person will film their episode here but like it does feel like it's not our set right now like i oh, feel really? like i'm on gals on oh, the i love guesting too i'm like uh, my brain doesn't have to be working anymore I love it brain so off. Yep. <laughs> girl mode on i also feel like we started our podcasts years ago for this very moment <gasps> You know what I mean? Ah! I feel like this is, it's been leading up for years. We're like, this is one of our most requested swaps. Oh yeah. Probably really? the most requested Same swap on our end. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. It's, it's like actually crazy. It took five, six years to happen, but like we yes. made it. Like we got over, we, we made it to the gals came to LA. I you guys are never here. No, no the last one was like two and a half years ago. Really? Yeah. Damn. That's crazy. Also, I love that you planned us like so much, so far in advance as a planner. I know. No, we I really loved did. it. It itched my brain. Like I was like, oh, oh, absolutely, I'll that. fill that in. Thank you so much. Now I know what I'm doing on the 19th. Like I'm good to go. Oh, I'm so I glad. Loved it. Right. I, I was it. like, they might get something better, but like <laughs> <laughs> things come up all the time. I feel like like travel yeah. opportunities or whatever. And you're yeah. like, damn, actually I won't be here. And you're like, well, we I'll actually be in Antarctica <laughs> with this brand. Exactly. Like, you know, oil yeah. rigging. Yeah, yeah. yeah. oil rigging. I don't know. Did you guys do that prank at all? I did. I missed it. I did. Oh my God, I need to, to Cal. I did it to Cal and Cal was like, that's weird. And then I did it to my dad and my dad's like the sweetest. Aww. Nothing bothers my dad ever. And I called my dad and he was, I was like, yeah, I got invited on a brand trip to go oil rigging. He's like, oh my God, that's amazing. You should still go. I mean, yeah, that one person died that one time, but like overall, it's actually really not that Stop unsafe. It. And I, I didn't post it because I was like, I think it is actually probably unsafe. It's so dangerous. Yes, I figured oh. that. So At I, least the um, videos I've seen. Yeah, no, I know it is. So I didn't post it because my dad was yeah. just like, la, 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 la. Then I called my mom because Ollie was like, you have to call her because she's like the really big worry wart. Oh. And I called her and I said, hi, mom. I got invited on a brand trip. And she goes, to go oil rigging? Because she watches everything before I even post it. Like, Stop. she's so on my shit. So oh my can I cuss on this show? Yeah. 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 She's so on my shit. So I was like, ah. I next time call mom first. Yep. So she saw cows first? She saw cows. Oh my oh, yeah. wow. She's on everything. She's watching notifications. Right on. Notifications on. Hi Sue. Hi Sue. Do you ever like like we have an episode coming up where we're gonna be like mom's like actually tune off? Like do you ever do that? Every now and then. <laughs> I, me specifically, I feel like you're so good. Just like you're like, I don't care. Yeah, she can hear it. I don't really mind it. M- me on the other hand, like there's times where I want to say that and then I'm like it's fine. Like, it's yeah. fine. You're 30 years old, Alicia. It's okay. Know, You're it's an like- adult. It's fine. But then every now and then, or then I'm like, but then is she going to like, will she actually keep, oh my God. One time I filmed a YouTube video and it was nothing, nothing was wrong. Like literally I just didn't want to think about my mom watching it. Right. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, I will be able to be more freely open and just talk. It was just sitting down and like doing one of those like heart to heart type videos. Mm-hmm. And in the intro, I literally go, mom, stop watching. 
Promise? Okay. Stop watching. <laughs> Did she stop? She literally took, honey, I loved your video. It was so good. You were so no. vulnerable. Blah, blah, blah. And I was like, mom, I literally told that you. That was quite literally for only not, you. Or just pretend. Pretend. You. pretend. Not why. And she's like, oh, I just thought you were being like silly and funny. And I was like, no, I said no. I'm being serious. Don't watch. Like you said it on camera. Yes. Yeah. So she was like, okay, next time text me and be like, no, like seriously. I was like, oh, my. I literally loved it in the video. It was so funny. My That's thoughts so are always funny. like, like, are our moms going to? Like, do you think your mom will say, oh, Brooke wants me. I'm going to put it down. Oh, I don't think my so. mom's going to be like, <laughs> yeah, I'm just I don't not going to listen. Yeah. But I'm knowing myself, like if you're like, Brooke, don't listen. I probably would keep listening. Yeah, of like, course. Don't I touch the red not, button. You know? Oh, yeah. I mean, I guess it depends. Like it, if you're like, I'm surprising you with something then I'd be like, OK, respectfully, maybe yeah. I won't. But yeah. Like, maybe that's what she would say. <laughs> oh, well, we're, I'm like Wait, so, so good. It was just like we're such a ballsy something. episode for us that I'm like, oh What'd my you talk God. about? You'll see. Okay. <laughs> Tune this in. Good. It's, it's just, it's, it's sexual. Yeah, I was going to say, yeah. I call my mom on the way home from losing my virginity, <gasps> which is oh, like, oh, oh, so you are okay, fine, so you're different. which is like weird, like, but hey, also like we have one of those, I'm no, like, you're people, not going to believe this. There's people. There's it people happened. With that relationship. I am not one of them. I am not one of them. Um, it's unfortunate. I will say, I luckily, my mom, like, if we ever do have more, like, episodes that are, like, more, like, sexual based or whatever, yeah. she never says anything about it. So I'm like, perfect. <laughs> That's what <laughs> totally we want. have, yeah, too. Yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah, they kind of, like, we're like, did they listen? Did I they know. Not? Yeah, they didn't uh, say they anything. anything about that so not then know. I'm like, is it better to not even say anything and just, like, let it be yeah. out there? Yeah. Or is it, I don't know. I, I still don't struggle. draw attention to it. <laughs> no. Yeah, I don't know. Just I pray get, she skips that one. It's yeah. so crazy because my mom, I feel like she, she would love to talk about it all with me, but that's why I don't want to. Same. <laughs> same? We're the same in this way. No, like, We're the same my mom, way. she would love for me to talk to her about things. I'm yes. like, no, we don't have that relationship. No. I, I don't need to talk about it with my daughter either. Like, I don't know. Like, yeah, we'll give the basis. That's kind of my boundary. Like, we, my mom and I are besties for the rest yeah. of us, but like, we kind of are like, that's. That's the you one know, thing. You know what I do? <laughs> late night. After <laughs> late night. Check my find my friends. Late yeah. night. When the vlog ends. <laughs> yeah. Night. My dad used to love listening to Pretty Basic, and then very early on, because that's when I had. It was just, like episode four. Yeah, we were like I was talking oh about certain things, and he was like, yeah. "Can't support this one, Rem. Love you. Oh, He'll tell love you. you, but I'm I'm gonna click off. So he doesn't yeah. listen anymore now. But my mom will watch her listen, and she'll yeah. like fill him in on the things he needs to know. Mm -hmm. But and I would actually rather he not listen to those. Oh yeah, my mom. I'm like whatever. That's fine. Dad. Yeah. No. I'm good. My dad said good. the same thing. He was like, I think it's not for me. I was like, You're right. <laughs> it's actually not for you. Yeah. Yeah. You are not the demo. Uh -huh. Not the demo. In fact, you're the exact opposite of the demo. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Actually, quite opposite. I feel like your dad. I mean, they come to the shows. Yeah. No. Only when they play. My mom plays it in the car. She's like. Brooke New Pod, he's probably like, oh, what's yeah. this one about? <laughs> My parents are divorced, so it's like, <laughs> 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 oh, I didn't think about it. They do a lot of road trips together, Brooke. Yeah, I know. Ooh. I know. They're a little it's backed okay. up on the episode. She's now, like, so let's see they... what's new with the girls. Yeah. And it's like, <laughs> oh my God, da, 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 da. Like, fuck, fuck. <laughs> we'll just change that one. <laughs> yeah. Um, a different tune. I uh, can't imagine having, like, if my daughter had a podcast, like, that would be crazy. Like, really yes. think about yeah. that? Yeah. Like my daughter just spills her beans out That's, to the world. I know. I've never considered that POV. Do you remember when you guys, like, I feel like there's multiple moments, but since we've all been doing YouTube for so long, like that moment where you were like, I just crossed a new barrier. Because I feel like we were all super PG. Yes. Oh, like about sure. drinking. Like G-rated. Or about drinking. Or, yeah, like all sure. your milestones. Is there a like rating before G? Because that's what. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Schoolie shot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like. But, like, do you remember, like, really any funny. specific moments? Like, I remember for me, people were so upset because I was, I would vlog in college and they'd say, Danielle, we know when you turn the camera off, you're going to drink. <laughs> and I was getting, it was, like, becoming a problem. I was like, guys, 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 oh, I'm just going to dinner. And they were, like, upset that I was lying, that I was just going to dinner. It's like, obviously, she's going out. She's in college. But I was, like, st I was underage. I didn't want to, like, get in trouble with those or anything. Yeah. Yeah. So, finally, I, like, made a video. And it, I didn't say it, but I was like, you guys. We all know what I'm doing, okay? Like, leave me alone. And that was, like, that was a big moment for yeah. me. I, feel like I, told, I remember the comments on that video. They were like, she told us. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, I did not like, know that. Yeah, it was, like, the scariest thing for me. But I was like, you guys need to shut up. Like, you, like, yes, that is what I'm doing. You're right. You got me. But I can't say it. You yeah. know? Also, with your RA, depending on your school, like, it, you, yes. you could get, yeah. like, could get like it was our, our sorority, honestly. It was a sorority yeah. that we were scared about. Like, I understand. You're not supposed to, like, post that you're drinking underage. Yeah. Like, even nationals or whatever. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, are they really going to, like, come for, like, probably? Not, but like, no, you know, but you Hi, there's a cup of in your photo here. Can you delete that? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey, girl. Hey, girl. Hey girl. Yeah, hey there's girl. a cup right here. Yeah. I understand. Yes, yes, yes. Um, for me, I remember we were filming Pretty Basic very early on, and I had just lost my virginity. <laughs> and I remember we were like, 
it, the episode was kind, of, was kind of ending. We had a really mm-hmm. sweet, like, very gentle producer oh from my our God. network. She was the nicest she woman in the world. So and I was like, it was kind of ending. And I was like, I mean, because I think you're like, what What have you been up to? Or like, what's been going on? And I was like, should I say it? And oh then Kirsten, because she didn't know. She was like, yeah. And I was like, I lost my virginity. And I'm, <laughs> she was like, oh. <laughs> oh, my God. I remember her, like, she was... So Keep in mind, nice. we had just started this pod and she was yeah. very like, come on, girls, like you can do it. Like, I know yeah. it's different, but like, I'm here. I'm your biggest cheerleader. Oh, so sweet. she's like, yeah, yeah Remy, go ahead and share it with the class. Uh-huh. Like, and she didn't know what that, it was, though. didn't know what it was. Yeah. And I remember she would be like, oh. <laughs> and then also at that time, I remember, <laughs> I think a lot of people, at least viewers, I feel like now I've recently understood more of, I think <laughs> it happened. I blanked. <laughs> No, I'm sorry. I was just laughing at the fact that I did that. <laughs> like, that's crazy. No, that's, and I know those like best friends moments. Like you were probably like, are you, are you, are you going to say this right now? Oh no. I was like, uh, we're going there. We're going there. We've, we've had a few of those. Where yeah. I'm like, I'm ready to tell a story. Literally like, the other day, Brooke said something. I was like, we're doing, okay. We're doing I'm, I'm, I'm yeah, here. Then I'm Danielle strapped. Too, like, Cause then we were like, we're then I did too. I was together. like, literally okay. us like sidelining just now before we recorded it. Yes, I yeah. wasn't saying anything. Cause I didn't know if you were going to say it. And then you said, and I was like, oh, we're going there. Yeah. Oh, I didn't know. But like, not my job to say. That's the best you think. Unless you say it. It's the best you say. And then you're like, what? Yeah. 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 Like, okay, so we're talking now. We're talking Uh, about it. uh, What I was gonna say is, I feel like a lot of viewers back then thought we were being like two faced or lying or whatever. But I feel like in reality, you're like, I don't know how to navigate this because Mm -hmm. I want to share this. Mm -hmm. However, one, I don't want to get kicked out of my sorority. I don't want to get in trouble with my school. Mm -hmm. I don't want my parents to see. And then also, like, you know, we just signed this new podcast deal, and we're like, are we able? Because we were more. I remember they asked us ahead of times, like for brands, like, what are you going to be talking mm. about? And we said stuff. So we were like, oh, is this at one point? I remember they're like, you guys need to tone down a little bit on the F-bombs. When yeah, we, we first started. Really? really? I feel we, like that's gone now. Though. When we first started. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's not a thing anymore. But it was just funny because from the brand side, too, that was a whole other thing. You know what it was? If you hit a certain amount of words, you had to be explicit. Yeah. Mm. I forgot. Yeah, I think it was like, oh. I think like it was seven like, or something. Yeah. Six or seven was a sweet spot. Yeah. But so there was all of that, I think, from was from our POV. It was like, yeah. no, like, we want to let you guys in and like show you these things. Yeah. But like, there's just so much more to it. Mine was like, I just didn't know how to. I didn't mm. mind it. I just was like, how do I show myself going out on the weekends when yeah. I've like never done this before? Because I didn't start going out till I was like 23. Right. Also, I feel like there wasn't any other YouTubers posting that. No. So now it was it's all like, over the place. Yeah. yeah. So, so even just the like how do do I bring my phone? Do I bring my vlog camera? They're yeah. going to take that away at the club. Like, how do yeah. I go about like, <laughs> like even just film, like showing other people, like exactly. little things Your friends like that. are like, we're also not trying yeah. to be like, yeah. Yeah. Don't yeah. Get yeah. 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 They're not asking to be oh on YouTube God. and like yeah. have that be memorialized forever. I no. feel like a big moment for me, which there were definitely smaller ones for sure. But a big one was honestly starting the truth or drink series mm. because that was, yeah. I feel like that was me finally being like, Okay, especially if I'm posting this on the main channel, because vlogs were like a little different, but I was like, okay, clearly like we can like joke about the past, like we can talk about Schoolisha and all these like old past mm-hmm. selves and stuff, but like I really want people to realize who I am now. Mm. Like I just I need that. Um but twenty when we became friends, a lot of people no, I say a lot, there was like a handful of like fans on both sides didn't like us hanging out because we both <laughs> because we what? both started we became like we really bonded over like going out and stuff. Mm, okay. So they just associated if they saw Remy with me and then now suddenly I'm a party girl. They're like, Remy's a bad influence and vice versa. I feel like they oh were like, gosh. like what's going on here? Like, oh my God, I don't like them together. This new friendship, blah, 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 blah. So like, I feel like even just us becoming friends was a first wave of mm. fans being like, oh, Alicia drinks. Um, <laughs> and I'm like, babe, you were just finding your own <laughs> together. Like no. you guys were finally feeling oh confident. My God. We, yeah. were, about it. we were just going through similar things at similar yeah. times and so just like out. confiding in each other for sure. So yeah, so much pivotal times and stuff. That's so interesting. Brooke, do you have any moments you remember? Um, I guess drinking too a little yeah. bit. You mean yeah. at Playlist Live? Yeah, <laughs> oh, when we were literally 16 <laughs> years old. When I used my fake idea Playlist I Live. Actually, yeah. I was going to say, Brooke, I have such a distinct core memory oh my God. of us on the dance floor. No. What was it the time that I dropped my drink and it shattered? Because I had my lap to do it. That was so embarrassing. Like, peak humiliation. Everyone that I adore is in this room. Her and vodka cran fell on the ground. Vodka I cran. I, <laughs> the slow mo, like it shatters. I'm like, boom. boom. Oh, we're <laughs> caught. We're caught. Oh my God. So yeah, I just have a core memory of so you. Funny. I remember like going in, like, because there was two lines, you know, like the undertone oh, yeah. and the over, and I was like going in the over and people like, here. 
you're not. And I was like, <laughs> guys, I am. A- <laughs> <laughs> you're like, you clearly don't know me. Yeah, like <laughs> I'm <laughs> gonna be fine. Yeah. I'm Brooke Michio, age 25. Tonight. <laughs> <laughs> you guys miss Playlist Live and VidCon? Like no. the OG? The oh, you don't. <gasps> well, I, I never didn't. like got into it. I feel like I just also because really? I wasn't, I didn't party at that time. Okay, so I don't, yeah, that it, it was like fine. It was it, like I enjoyed like yeah. seeing everybody, but mm-hmm. I didn't love it as much as like certain people I who were like. Loved it. Peak. I loved yeah. it. It's a, part, a core part of Danielle personality <laughs> no, really? like drinking Bacardi in a hotel room with Kevin Droniak and his like, grandma <laughs> like his grandma his grandma would show up like Wait, I swear you I were remember at that one. being at a party yes. and everyone's like Kevin's grandma yes, yes. In the hotel. she opened the door that's I was like, right oh, I know so so funny and I was scared she was mad at me because I was under a drink and she didn't know. I remember she you freaking out that's right she, she was just happy to be there oh, I know grandma that's yeah hysterical. I wish I partook more like I feel like I would have had way more fun had I been I wish we were cooler fun. like I wish we were friends then i know i like knew of you but i didn't know you That's, so when Were did you, you sorry no no oh my what? god you want to hear how we first met yeah i don't want to hear my first interaction with alicia i hate, I I hate this. this this is so oh. this is literally so embarrassing oh my god stop it's so funny but you like you guys will get it yeah <laughs> obviously i knew i knew who well not not because of that just like because they were there don't worry i know don't get it. <laughs> <laughs> is she i knew she lived in riverside and uh I ended up going to school in Riverside. And so I was like, oh my God, this is my time. It's like an like, hour from here. Okay. So Southern California. Cannot wait to become best friends with Alicia Marie. My mom always was like, mm. that Alicia girl's so nice. Like, I think you'd be really good friends. I was like, mom. She is in Did the Did she like know. watch Alicia's videos? So in the know. She she watches everybody. Really? Oh, everybody. Wow. Definitely okay, you cool. guys too. She loves everybody. That's and so, so really cool. she was like, you should really be friends with Alicia. And I was like, don't tell me who to be <laughs> friends with, mom. Like, yeah. I was like, mom, I'll make my own friend. <laughs> And then uh, I was so excited to go to Riverside because it's like a small mm-hmm. city. I was like, I'm definitely going to see her. Just so happens that when I get there is the year that she moved away. Mm. Literally. And so I missed her. And I was like, it's fine. Oh. The year is 2015. And I got invited to my first beauty con. And I was <gasps> so excited, obviously. And I tell this story all the time. <laughs> I uh, remember going to a rooftop pool party. And I went with Ava. So it was just Ava and I mm-hmm. coming from Orange County. Drove up. And when we get there, we're at like the pool rooftop. And I see Alicia, Mia, and Sierra there. And I'm like, oh, oh my God. <laughs> it's my time to shine. Oh, my God. And so I'm like, <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> You got this oh bitch. God, and I walk up to Alicia and I'm like, and you know, I'm like, hi, say hi to everybody. Everyone's so nice. And oh, at one point no. Alicia's like sitting alone. So I'm like, this is your time. Like really your tell time. Tell her you're from, you're, you're going to school in Riverside, like common oh, ground. Like God. this is amazing. So I go up to her and I'm like, hi, Alicia. She's like, hi, Remy. Oh my God. Nice to see you. I was like, I just want to say like, I live in Riverside now. Like I was like, I, I know that you're from there. And she's like, oh my God. Yeah. And we're like making small talk. And then I go, I'm like, I've crushed it. Like I'm doing so well. Oh, I got, so I got to wrap this up. So I end on a high note. I actually just saw that you hit 100,000 subscribers. That's so amazing. Congratulations. It's actually 250,000. <gasps> Stop. <laughs> and then I it's was so like, oh my God, I'm so sorry. I should have checked Social Blade. Like, it's so my bad. I'm no! so sorry. And then I walked away. I would have never, I mean, like, that Alicia girl's a bitch. I'd be like, oh my God, I would have made, I would have That's made. so not like you. I distinctly remember. Oh, that's I was, not her. It's, like, no, it's not, not Alicia. It's not, it's not. But I just like, the fact that that's, you, like our first interaction pains That's me. That's iconic. That's right. so funny. Me. It's so funny. It pains I me. I should have checked. No. Should have no, checked. No, no. That's a I big I can't believe you actually want to talk to me after that. I remember being so excited because I never had viral moments in my life. Mm-hmm. And that like month I grew 100K. Wow. And that like has never happened. So I, everyone yeah, was like hard. congratulating me on that. And I remember like Style Hall, they were like giving me attention finally. Style finally. Hall. Finally. And I was like, oh my God, I've made it. So I was yeah. so excited. And then when she said that, I like why the fuck did I crack her but I did but I was really oh, excited you were, like I'm proud no no but that's so cringe and literally like I it wouldn't shock me if you made like a I hate Alicia Mac, Mac, baby, 11, Mac, baby, Mac baby 11 expose Stop. <laughs> I love TikTok was story time like, you'd be like hey guys I just got home from a party no, I literally. love to do that oh God, this one so influence yeah. yeah. and then the comments are all tagging people like was it at Alicia Marie <laughs> yeah, yeah. nope she's March safe not her like, <laughs> she, was, she wasn't at the party she oh my God. no yeah. it's insane it's crazy I I apologize again. Those I will apologize. Again. You're yeah. so fine. That has actually happened to us. We were like out of town and there was this one yes. event that happened <gasps> and they were like this 
these few girls and people were like I know it wasn't Brooke and Danielle because they're not in town yeah. don't you love yeah. when you're like here I go moving yeah. away I have my alibi yeah. yes. it's like when you weren't invited you're like nope wasn't invited yeah. Yeah. Anyway. so <laughs> we're being so petty we were like actually the gals weren't invited but we'll go to the next one yeah. I like, love when people are bold and like comment though and they're like nope wasn't me no yeah. I know you know what I mean I love that like it would never be me but I Why love would, it she wouldn't do that me? Bro? Oh, yeah. 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 Nope, wasn't there. I literally do. Like, Actually, oh, I was at a show. No, but they broke, me, she will comment. Like, Danielle will probably click on it and see that I already commented back. I'm like, what? <laughs> Anything? Like, yeah, she's wasn't always me. in. She's on. Yeah. Brooke <laughs> is someone, she's like always checking her activity on TikTok, like the comments, and I can't. Like, oh, I, I, I do. But people tag me in like funny videos that are like, For you sure. know, that I relate, that, that they I think I would that. like. And I'm, I try to stay engaged. Do you get that from your mom? Is she, is that how your mom is? Engaged, like just on like, social media, just like, like, oh, like, or direct, direct. Oh, one. I feel like I, I get that vibe oh, from her. Yes. yes. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. Even more so than me. Like I feel like I'm a filtered down version. Uh, I still like get weird with, especially like work confrontation. Like mm-hmm, people, understand. you know, like in professional settings. Like I feel like I sound like I'm so scary. I'm like, and I told them to screw themselves, and then I'm like, yeah. I told them that I didn't like the way they did that. Like, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's fine. <laughs> yeah. 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 I feel like I talk, we always say that I feel like I, I give off like the tough vibe, but then like actually I'm like, she's actually very mushy. Like, yeah. Oh, no, yeah, yeah, tread lightly. Or I like like cute memes and shit. Like I'm like one of those. Like I get the like, duality. I like yeah. it. I know. Get you a girl that can do both. Yeah, yeah absolutely. <laughs> um, okay, so we had you guys do some homework. Fave and rack yes. of yes. the week. So we're gonna start with things we're loving, and I'm just so excited to hear what the pretty basic gals are yes. loving right now. So we'll start with favorite, like product, item. Yeah, just, just one. do favorite, just one, just, just one. one. Yes. I know this was hard to pick. Just one. Narrow you can it down. go first. I have, I have a lot, but I'm okay. gonna do one that I've talked about a lot, and it is expensive. That's okay. But, okay, that's what I wasn't sure about. I was like, uh, but I have talked about it a lot, and I really feel like it's done such wonders for my skin. Oh the my Omnilux face mask light. Yes. I haven't seen. Is it a red she light? Loves that thing. Uh huh. It has actually changed my skin. Wow. I mean, oh, it looks it's like yeah, you look great. I have so much makeup on my face. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> but I truly like. It's four hundred dollars, so it's really expensive. But when I actually thought about it, I was like, I have bought hundred dollar serums at like Sephora that I use oh. once, and like it doesn't work or whatever. So many times, and like. If I had just never bought the girl math, if I had never bought those and just done this is girl actually math. like so much better, you know? Um, and it truly like it within like not even two times of using it, I noticed a difference. And it honestly wow. like actually works. Like red I still keep light, it on for it. Yeah. It's, so many questions. It's, it's red light and then it's only 10 minutes. They say to use it like two to three times a week. So I'll just do it like every other night. I'll take off my makeup, put it on. And I love how it's just chargeable. Like you don't need a special gel or yeah. goo to use it. Like there's so many machines that's like, you need the activator shit. And I'm like, I just want like, I'm so lazy. So I'm like, yeah. I just put it on. And I don't forget there. the neck thing. Though. Oh yes, she's so got a full neck brace. You I got the neck attachment. I, I got the face thing, and then I bought the neck, like the décolleté one. I've so it goes these. around the neck and here. So I literally just lay and I look like a stormtrooper for ten minutes, <gasps> and it's great. And then it's done. Wow, anti aging, yeah. right? Omnilux. Yeah. Like, what do you see the most difference? Honestly, my the redness in my skin. Oh, okay. I feel like that's oh, what like I've always struck. Yeah, evenings out skin oh, tone wow. for sure. Um and. Yeah, I even I made a TikTok review about it. Literally, it was not sponsored at all. Like, I was yeah. like, I just need to show this. And the comments, li- they were like, wow, I see a difference, which is, like, wow. huge. Especially on TikTok, like, people are looking for, like, Oh, the they'll tell you. Yeah. Oh, my God. And I was like, this was only a month after using it. So, I feel like now I've, like. Did you take before and afters? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, like, oh, put them in the video, I'm too. running to no, this video No, I'll send after. you the link. Yeah. It's, it's so good. Wow. Perfect. Love that. I have the Dr. Dennis. I just got Me the too. Dr. Dennis yes. Rose one. Yes. And it's I'm only gonna- three minutes, though. So, now I'm wondering. I do, like. Three minutes on the blue and three minutes on the red, though, so I make it six. Yeah, well, because blue's for acne, right? Yeah, I'm like, I yeah, gotta do both. Oh, I love it. I wonder if it will actually, I, I feel like I need to track it and, like, Yeah, I'm not good at, like, see, we talk about this sometimes, like, Consistency? Which, yeah, oh, which, or what's the, what the variable is, like, what is actually working? When well, that's like, why I, li- I swear after even one time, I was like, oh, it does look brighter, yeah, but it must impressive. be a coincidence. I was like, it must be a coincidence. Mm. So then after doing it a few times, but also, um... My facialist recommended it to me, and her skin's perfect, which, granted, she, like, invests so much time and energy into her yeah. skin. That's but her job. Anything she, like, <laughs> yeah. recommends, I buy. I'm, like, buying. Like, wow. I love her so much. Um, so she right. recommends. Sarah Ford, love you. But, yeah. How often do you get a facial? Um, I have it in... Math. Like yeah, you're like, I don't know. Well, some like, people like, yeah. does one this year, maybe oh, two. Oh, okay. So you're not like weekly or no, 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 no. Yeah. Okay, cool. No, no, no. So that's my favorite. Thanks for The way sure. you said my facialist, I'm like, oh, so you have like a standing like Tuesday appointment. Oh, no, <laughs> no, no, no. no. <laughs> like, yeah, I just Tuesday. only see her. Um, no, that's yeah. great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's smart. That's epic. I feel like people have their shit together have a facialist. 
Yeah. So you, my you, facialist says. Yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> I'm a statistician. I just remember being, oh, well, one, I've always been insecure of my skin. This is a tangent. Sorry. Um, and I finally one day was like, I'm actually going to try. <laughs> I'm yeah. like, let me, let me try. It's so and true. a friend recommended her to me. So then ever since I was like, oh, okay. And queen. you know what the biggest thing was? She was like, you're using too much. Like you need a gentle cleanser. I always oh, thought my skin could yeah. handle so mm-hmm. much more. And she's like, no, like you, like you need a gentle cleanser and moisturizer. Like that's it. And I was like, wow. I expect it to be like a 12 step. Like, right. That's yeah. what you want. You're like, yeah. Like, load it up. Like, tell me what to buy. Um, and then the $400 face mask. So yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you literally just need a $3 face mask. <laughs> <laughs> just use CeraVe and then the yeah. omni It's perfect. But save your money on buying all the cleansers yes. and put it towards the mask. Exactly. Yeah. Okay. Oh, girl mask. Yeah. And then you don't have to go to a spa to like get the LED because that shit is expensive when oh, you yeah. like actually go somewhere to get it done. Totally. Yeah. Totally. I get kind of claustrophobic too when they put them like at the facial. Me too. Yeah, it scares me. So like at home, I could rip it off if I need yeah. to. You're so yeah. right. At any, <laughs> at any given point. This is so point, girl mask. The whole thing. It's so really, yeah. girl talk. How about you, Remy? What are you loving? Okay, mine's on the other spectrum. Mine's <laughs> very inexpensive, so we'll bring you one of Perfect. each. I love it. Um, I've love been really it. liking the, which I mean, this went viral on TikTok, so everyone knows. But the Elf, uh, I, sh- I should have looked up Halo the Glow Liquid Filter. That one, um, really amazing. Got you. Yeah. Amazing. I just got it. I've been using the Charlotte Tilbury one for years, mm-hmm. and then I tried the Elf one. Mm-hmm. So much better. I have really? a lot of um, like acne scars and pigmentation to cover up so much better coverage it's thicker Six yeah dollars damn i like putting the whole the big doe foot all over my face <laughs> yeah. so fun and it just makes your skin look so glowy i'm doing my best friend's wedding makeup um <gasps> slightly on accident it just didn't work out with the people that she hired wow. um and i used it and she was like can i just use this for the wedding wow. i said no because you're gonna get a lot of photos but, yeah, but that's a telltale yeah. exactly we could use it as the base and it's gorgeous and glowy and so Your skin looks yeah. great. <gasps> Thank you. That with the House Labs foundation. <gasps> that we love. We that. Oh, good. Yeah. Yes. We're late good. to the game. And the House Labs yes. blush. Like, oh, I haven't I tried that. Oh, <gasps> liquid or powder? It's powder, but we said it's, it last it's week. It's kind of creamy. Ooh. Okay. It's so pigmented. Yeah. So pigmented. Lady Only Gaga. a little. Like, literally, like, one swoop, and then it's okay, okay, yeah, okay. so good. Yeah, the foundation is so good. It's. I love the foundation. I feel like it's just changing me into a new human. I agree. And the there's, like, way. skincare in it, too. Really? I think so. Mm-hmm. Good to know. Yeah, We're I think so. Ourselves. That duo. Can I say, too? That duo together. Yeah. Chef's kiss. That's Chef's, good to yeah. know, because I went and purchased the Elf, and I think <gasps> I just bought the wrong shade. I didn't, like, it just looked a little orangey on me. But okay. So I just need a rematch. I think try match. try the two together with the kimchi chic powder. Oh my god! Oh, what's the what's the what's that third one? I'm just doing three. Um, yeah. It's like a, it's a loose powder and it's amazing. It it's amazing. amazing. Kimchi Love? kimchi chic. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's kimchi, a brand. What's her you name? Is it kimchi? Seen... Is her name is the drag queen? Kimchi. Kimchi's a drag queen oh, that's and amazing. All of her products are amazing, but the powder specifically, what also like multi mega viral on TikTok. You've seen but, it on the app, like the shop. Oh, yes. oh, it's I got the legit. Legit. It's mm-hmm. so good. Purple it. Our oh, um, yes. makeup artist uses it on us. And I bought like six and I put them in everyone's stockings for Christmas because I was like, everyone needs this. It, it like, locks you in. Airbrush. Amazing. I cannot recommend that trio. This. While we're talking about other products. Please. Yesterday I did a drugstore versus luxury TikTok mm. thing. Ooh, I love when you do those. The Trader Joe's Laneige dupe. I saw the chocolate strawberry, right? Stop I it. did the amazing. Really? Uh, it's five bucks. I always walk past that section. At Trader I Joe's. just saw it. It, okay, it cool. literally is the same like container too. Yeah. I see. And I, I truly, I, I guessed it right because the Trader Joe's one is basically half my lips were the Trader Joe's. The other half was the actual Laneige. Mm-hmm. The Laneige one was a slightly thicker and I was like, okay, mm-hmm. I can see that. But visually on it was like identical. It but was how insane. did it feel? It still felt really good. The okay. other side was just thicker mm, i don't but, like how thick it is sometimes so that's like, what i was i was yeah. like i think some people would actually prefer this because yeah. it's more of a obviously it's not a sleeping mask it's like a you, vaseline feel yeah like yes and i when, like hate dipping my finger into it i, I know. just feel it like i'm like there are germs everywhere i know yeah it's under my finger i should be more worried uh-huh. about that. I, it just lives in my head i'm like oh, dirty i always hand. flick up Oh, that's oh a good especially with nails, so it's yeah. not under your nail. You like flick up, lick up, yeah. lick up. Life hack. I Are you guys gonna share powder. products too? Yeah. Yo, buy it. I'll send you a link. It's so amazing. Please do. Good. I'm amazing. always looking, especially because I feel like we're all on camera a lot with the uh-huh. lights. You need to something to lock you in. You'll look. You look airbrushed. I I'm kid you so not. Yeah, you're, do you you're, both have it on, or do you have it on, Remy? I don't think I, I do, but on. I know you do. It's so like I mean it's been like seven hours, but skin, I'm though. shook. No, you don't have any diet. oil. Like it's very impressive. Truly, okay. I'll send you a link. Oh okay, God. cool. Mm-hmm. We're in. What's your favorite? We're in. <laughs> my favorite. I actually don't know how to pronounce this brand. You know, like SK Dash I Yes, SK Two. SK Two. Yes. Debong. SK Two. 
A ski, ski. ski, I know, ski. <laughs> I loved that. Um, I recently learned the power of essences. Mm. I never understood it. And then I had Castamigo on AM Uncovered, and she was talking about how before she does any of her skincare, she uses an essence because it basically wets your face. So you can obviously just use water, but you use <laughs> essence, mm. and then it helps absorb the rest of the products. And I'm seriously feeling uh-huh. like, and who knows? But I feel like then I put my hyaluronic serum. Like I just feel like I have my whole life. It's supposed together. to get like deeper into your skin. Yes, like because, versus just the the yes, the dermis or whatever. Yeah. Okay. Look Ollie's at me. big on skincare, and yeah. he's nodding. I know. Yeah. Yeah. He knows. Is this, am I saying the right thing? Ish. It, like, yes. That's what I'm, yes. And it made know. sense. At first I was like, huh? But it makes sense because your skin's so dry and you're just like, they hate when I say this, raw dog in it. So then <laughs> if you put essence on, I feel like it just feels like it's doing something and it's a beautiful bottle. I'm happy to have it out on my counter. And if it feels it's red, good. It feels good. It's too. red. It's the red logo like with a, like a nice You've top. seen the commercials for it. I'm going to buy this. Okay. Yeah. I, I love influencing. You send me a link. I'll send you yeah, a link. we'll we'll trade the links. Yeah. We just got the Tacho ones today, though, so I'm curious to try that. But I feel like any yeah. essence is just great. But this is the one I'm using. So Wait, I love start it. with essence first. Yes, yeah, before anything. Activate. Okay, and then serum, and then like the creams <laughs> after, I guess, because serums it. will soak in the m- second most oils. On top of that, I'm learning still. Yeah, yeah the but then but then it goes lot. back to oh, just use cleanser. So I don't. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, but there is an order of like mm-hmm. yeah, what to do serums. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is last. I have to learn that. Like your creams and the thicker products in your oil yeah 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 i need a visual like i love those little graphics that show you like that's how my brain handles it i need a photo yes i need a photo like the little with the little like drawings Mm -hmm. like oh my me at a a restaurant if there's like photos on the menu like thank god yes i need to visually see gotta google it if not the the other night we yelp review yeah when the drinks have photos yeah we love that so good what cup is it gonna come in exactly like i need that's gonna am i gonna embarrass myself yeah are my sizzling fajitas gonna cause a stir? Yeah. <laughs> Do I want them? Yeah. <laughs> All right, my favorite's also on the inexpensive side. Um, it's the, I mean, you could pick it up at any drugstore. It's really easy. The Listerine, it's called like the Cool Mint Spray. I, I saw love. you do it. Obsessed. I like love it, it just slides right in. Um, <laughs> this is, slides, slides right in your right bag. In. Like, no, yeah. well, slides in your mouth. <laughs> slides right in your purse, too. I like gum. I love yeah. gum. But I, I feel like I'm just rude chewing gum. Me and like, too. we're podcasting and stuff. Like, I'm not going to be chewing You're gum. You're constantly having to spit. You're like, wait, let me spit out my gum. Yeah. yeah. yeah it's a whole yeah. thing. Yeah. And sometimes I just feel like I'm like, Tom thinks I'll add that. Yeah. Like, no, I want the cooling refresh. The strips you had me try yesterday. I, I can't. They burn a little bit. They I burn. Love a strip. I love a you strip. You know what? I had the strip. It came in a pack. It was the strip yep. and the spray, and that's what I had in my bag. Yep. <laughs> oh, I get it. I get <laughs> but it. I do prefer the spray as well. Yeah, and we've just been, like, on the go, and, like, I, I don't know. Oh, you you know what breath spray that? reminds me of? Breath, breath spray reminds me of, like, the TV shows we'd watch when we were Kissing. younger. Yeah, where it's like, <laughs> and then he leans over. Yeah. I don't know why that's what I think if of. If someone... <laughs> Someone actually did that in front of me. Like, oh my, like, oh my god, I would cringe. I don't them. think I would hate it. Friends I mean, like, I would want you. them. I know, yeah. It's, it's just like, like in the movies, it's so like so played yes. out. Like, do it when I, yeah, like do it, but yeah. I want to see it. Yes. Yeah, I want to go to the yes. and run to the bathroom first. Yeah, that's always an interesting thing. I'm always caught. Like, I feel like I'm we're both, self-conscious like, of my breath like, right now. Like, yeah, I, I just been thinking about I mean, it, but I'm like, is it because we just? Fine. Yeah, we yeah. did eat, but I'm like, is it offensive? Like, I don't want it to be like that SpongeBob episode. I'm so scared. Then, when it like comes like, on, am I ugly? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so no, it's, it's, it's my favorite. It's like two bucks, and you throw it in your purse, and then you don't have to worry about you've offending in, people. You've influenced me to get breast spray. It's really? yeah. yeah. Brooke influenced me to get some. Yeah, yeah I know. Now Danielle's over. Yeah, <laughs> she she bought it, and then for live shows, now we'll just like both go in for the meet and greet. Yeah. Yeah. That's honestly such totally. a good good note. Like that's the last thing I need on the internet. Danielle, bad breath. Like I, it's hard to come back from that. You it's know what hard. I mean? Like I'd rather literally so many other things. Would you rather someone say that you were rude to them at a party or ask oh, if they had 200 uh, correct yeah. their subscriber <laughs> <laughs> I feel tired. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, that was so good. No, I mean, no, you're right. I would rather so breath, good. I guess, but it's it's a it's I something. Guess. It's like I could have easily just fixed that. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So, you can't go. Really, can't get a time. Because it comes no. across can't, like you don't take care of yourself. No, but like yeah. you do. So I get it. Yeah, we like, do. Like I do brush my teeth. I swear. Like, yeah, I just ate air one you buffalo chicken no, or whatever the fuck that was. What was it? I I own one. Oh yeah, the metal one. I own one. <laughs> you know what? I I do probably once a week after like eat something really weird. I'm like, ooh, I feel it in the back. Of my yeah, mm. I, I, I like scrape every, every day. Morning. 
and every it, morning. I just I look forward to it. I feel like oh it makes God. a really big difference it in like does. breath and also for health. I think I think there's like yes. health benefits. Uh-huh. Yeah, and it's satisfying it's when you like so oh, it's disgusting. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, ooh, but like, like overnight, I developed you that feel much. Clean. I feel so clean. Yeah, I gotta get back on it. Thank you. I recommend. Yeah, it. I do it like with so my clean. toothbrush. There's like a mode on my toothbrush that's like tongue. <gasps> oh, cool. Like it's one of the, you know, it's like uh, Mac Daddy electric. Toothbrush. Does that not make you feel weird though? That it's like going there and it's going on the. It's all in my mouth though. I know. If you think about it, all the it's definitely all the same drip. Like my tongue goes on my teeth. Yeah, yeah true. Brooke roasted me yesterday because oh, I because we're traveling. <laughs> no, I get it. You're traveling. You bring whatever toothbrush you can get. Mm-hmm. You know, I have a travel electric toothbrush, mm-hmm. like a little one that vibrates. I mean, it's like fifteen bucks, whatever. It's like a tooth tunes, correct? <laughs> yeah, the tooth tunes. Exactly. No, it's the Sonic yes. Air, Philips, whatever. I yeah. had it too. I didn't know they have travel ones. Yes, oh my they god, don't they're have amazing. All of the functions, like it's just yeah. on and off, just vibrates. It <laughs> okay, yeah. okay. So then I asked Danielle. I was like, at home. Do you use an electric toothbrush? <laughs> and I immediately go, I knew you were going to fucking judge me for this because I was using just like a plain like jam. One. <laughs> because I, it was, I was grossed out by my Sonicare one because I had it for years and like I switched. It's also big and you don't want to have yeah. to travel with it. Yeah. No, well, I have a travel. I have the one that oh, she has. Okay, okay, okay. And I knew, I, you know when you just know someone's going to say something? Oh, like, yeah. Yep, yep. She's like over there, like it's vibrating. She's like doing the whole thing and I'm like raw like, <laughs> like really doing it and she was just like do you have a-? i was like yes i do i just like haven't gotten a new one yet like it was the whole thing do you guys use electric <laughs> yeah <laughs> yeah after no. all that i so hope so. i do sorry no go ahead i was gonna say i do but i didn't know so when i travel i always bring like a little normal yes, ass thing. travel yeah. one and because it's just easier mm. but that's why i was mind blown about the it's on amazon yeah. it's, it's not expensive at all and they're cute colors too uh-huh. yeah, it's, it's definitely because yeah this, the right. normal one is so big and i'm like you're not no gonna bring, bring that. that yeah mm-hmm. sometimes have, she does i bring my normal one i have one yeah. big one and i bring it with me it has like a cup that you put it in and it charges in the cup and then you oh, can, that's like, nice. use the cup Great. as like a mouthwash bottle. dedication oh. um, but where was i going with that Toothbrushes, electric toothbrush, toothbrush, electric. Oh, I know. I'm now really insecure about the way that I brush my teeth, though, because I did like a day in the life TikTok once, and I was brushing my teeth. And I, ugh, please cut this if I sound so dumb. I didn't know that like with an electric toothbrush, you don't need to like vigorously like move it around as much no, as like with I a think people real forget. toothbrush. Mm-hmm. I didn't know, and so someone texted one of my manager's friends. Texted my manager was like, Stop. "Hi, please let Remy know that she does not need to vigorously move the toothbrush Especially like with that." Veneers. Yeah, <laughs> then he was oh like, God. "You could just hold it there and like." The toothbrush it does, the, does the job. I was like, well, no one oh, ever I taught me how to I, I definitely still move. Move. I, I have to change to. my my brush heads out a lot because I'm like over there like vigorously <laughs> yeah. brushing. I, now whenever I film myself doing a clip of washing, brushing my teeth, I'm just like, Oh, you're like, I'm so embarrassed. No, someone said yeah. I chewed weird one time. So now I like, someone said no. I chewed theatrically. And now I'm nervous. <laughs> what does that even mean? You know what? I was filming like a, not a what I eat in a day, but I was doing a food thing. Yeah. And was I think. Was it for the, like an ad? Is that why? No, no. Oh. It was like, I was walking around Bryant Park and I was like, hmm, very good. So maybe it was like, mm, you know what I mean? And they're like, it got a lot of likes. Like wow. people don't realize the insecurities they put in us. No, no. You're, like, you're thinking about your toothbrush no, now. And I'm just sitting there like, <laughs> I hope that was a long enough but clip. Also, oh, I would think ready. it's weird if you just did that. I know. Like, you're supposed to move it a little bit. Yeah, it's yeah. like serial killer vibes. I'm just like, Gee. yeah, that's normal. I, I will say, I Take recently, that. my toothbrush is dead. Oh. So you're back on she the She hasn't been brushing her teeth. No. no. <laughs> So basically, <laughs> she's like, I finger, really need that list. Using her spray. finger. <laughs> I'm like, I'm all, I already ordered it. I already yeah. ordered it. So I've been having to do it like normal. And I like, I lost my charger. So I need to buy a new one. Mm. And I'm like, how did we do this for years? I love a manual toothbrush though. I do. No, I it's really giving clean. me nostalgia or something. Nostalgia. Like, it's been fun while I travel. <laughs> wow. I'm really yeah. happy for you. I, I do believe you have clean teeth. I just was wondering. No, I mean, I do get lots of cavities. So like, and you know that. Like, <laughs> yeah. And you know that. No, it's a problem. Like, like, yeah. I have sensitive teeth. Yeah, but Danielle uses like well. alternative toothpaste. I'm like, just get the fucking no, Colgate. No, like, it's okay. probiotic. It's oh. not probiotic. Ah, it's, um, stop. Like, <laughs> it has a ton of flora. It's like literally prescription toothpaste. Like, oh, that's where wow. I'm at. So I do care about my teeth, but yeah. Because I drank, guys, because I took so many ginger shots. Like, I was taking <gasps> like two a day. Oh, my yeah. enamel was cut. Now I can't do it as much. Oh, you need that shot straw. I know. That's, I know, but I don't enjoy it as much. <laughs> Yeah. Like I want to. I forgot that was your thing. Yeah, that's right. And I literally had to. Like I've taken a couple while we're here because I don't know something about LA makes me want to. Like we've been drinking juices and ordering <laughs> yeah, sunlight. The wellness and, they infuse yeah. it into everything. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. Every so. part of life. Yeah. I mean, you can't just have regular cauliflower. It has to be buffalo probiotic. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> it's like literally everything. Has Organic grass fed. Yeah. 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 
<laughs> um, okay, let's do our recs because we have so much more. Oh my god! Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So like book, movie, TV, like anything that entertainment wise that you're like in when you're following. Oh. Could be anything you recommend. My thing was nothing to do with entertainment. It doesn't have to be. I'm just giving okay. examples. As someone who's not a morning person, but working on it for my AM Uncovered yep. episode, <laughs> I have started putting a water mister by my bed. And when I wake up in the morning, instead of going back to sleep, I'll just spray my face Shut a bunch up. of times and it actually wakes you up. Is it like a psh, 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 or is it like a I got a fine mister, so I go, oh, sh- micro mist. Like Good. three micro mists through the eyes because then like once, you're, wow. once your eyes are open, you're like, why would I go through back the to the eyes? Bed now? I'm just okay. like imagining you waking up and like spraying no, yourself no, I with really water. I, I, not even like it's not graceful. I'm like on my side and I'm like reaching for it with my eyes closed in the dark and I just spray. And then wow. once you spray, you're up. Like Especially you might as well cold. just wake up. Oh my god, yeah. That yeah. feels like punishment though. I know. It is, okay. I don't, don't want to wake up, but it's it really oh. gets you up because like I'm not gonna go back to sleep now that my eyes are open. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Because once I wash my face, like yeah. normally I'll lay in bed, I'll probably go back to sleep. Eventually I'll get myself up and then I'll go wash my face. But I'm like, might as well start the process. Get it going. Yeah. Hey, and it's I your have essence. to recommend it's <laughs> my essence. It's my essence. So I have to recommend for people who are not morning people but wanna be big game changer. Wow, oh, I'm obsessed. Yes. I'm intrigued. What about you? Um, I have a rec of a uh, an influencer who I'm love. obsessed. Yes. Always love this. Let's do it. I feel like if you guys love the fashion, I'm in. Yeah. Stuff, yep. You're gonna love her. Her name's Maxine Wild. I don't remember. Tell me. She does. She basically mm-hmm. uses like sh- colors. She'll be like using like these colors. I'm gonna make an outfit, and they're like oh. crazy colors, but they go together with like color theory. And then Ooh. she's like, for the top, I'm going to go with this shirt. Like, maybe it's like chartreuse pink and like a yellow. And I'm like, I would never make a... Co- she looks so fucking good. And it wow. literally makes me want to like buy more colorful things. And like, she's so cute. She's got engaged too. Like, she's like so... Uh, like, she's like showing her shoes and they're like such like cool, cool girl outfits. I love And I'm love. she totally inspired me to start doing more like fashion Oh, I was going to say. Yeah. Because I'm like, oh my God, like I could... You, now you're going to notice because she's in her closet. And then I like, I'm in my yeah. closet doing mine. <laughs> You've broken the barrier. Yeah, but she... <laughs> I like I feel like I've learned a lot of just like wow like and I miss like being obsessed with uh, like a creator or influencer yeah. you know? yes it's exciting she too. deserves so many more followers than she has like honestly is she, like tiktok or youtuber Instagram? mostly reels i would okay. say how do you spell her name i'm having trouble finding um oh you're oh, looking i got her i got her oh my got god her. What is, how do you spell it um wild like w-y-l-d-e ah oh she's stunned oh her outfits are really cool there she is <gasps> Yeah, yeah, oh, she's so cute. cool. She wears color. Brooke's into wearing color right now. She did, instead white today, of 75 yeah. hard, she did like 75 um, hard, Outfits? but for fashion. Oh, So every day oh. she made an outfit. And she was like, this is actually great because like I wouldn't have worn something like this day, but it, I, I wanted to be comfy, but it still put me out of my comfort zone. And I'm like, Alicia, just try wow. harder. Very impressive. Just try a little harder. No, it's so crazy. Like just picking one piece out of your closet, like you really can make an outfit, but you think you can. Oh my God, like, totally. I just need some, I need to go to Zara, like something. But also it's like, it's one outfit. Like one you outfit. can change again. It's not like, yes. you're, I, like I feel yeah. like I get so indecisive because it I feels know. like it's such a commitment. I'm like, it's one day, you can change it. You're so right. No, thanks, I'm following her. Yeah, right no, now. she's so great. Um, so I don't know where she is. Maybe she's, uh, she has an accent. I think she's Australian herself. I love Australian people. But, they make they have the best. Uh, yeah, her emails yeah. dot com dot au. Okay, so. uh, yeah. I don't. I was gonna say I'm, I'm not sure if she lives there still, but that would make. There's sense. There's some affiliation. Love. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. Brooke, what's yours? Uh, my rec. Um, I don't know if this is a thing in LA, but it's this app called Meal Pal. Okay, <gasps> it's on your vlog. It's I'm intrigued genius. by it. I, like, I just think it's a brilliant concept. I'm confused how they're making money. So you buy credits, basically. Like, uh, I, I don't know what a pack of credits would cost you, and those credits will get you. You can buy like the lunch plan or the dinner plan. And they can they collaborate with like restaurants all over New York City, and you click uh, like pick up your order, and then you set it for a specific time. And every restaurant will offer one dish, so they'll do sweet green, but like they'll only have like the market bowl. Got it. And you can use some of your credits for that, or like a local like a sushi place will be like you know this uh, sashimi platter or something, but like it's only that, no changes, no modifications. But basically, you're buying the credits for less money than like. If that meal would actually cost. Does it change daily? Like, is, does the sweet mm. green one change a lot, or is it always the market one? It changes. I actually did notice that it was something different, or sometimes oh. it's not available. Like, you know, maybe they don't have it for two days, and then like they have something out. They have, like the kale Caesar. That's or it. it's like a surprise when you pick it up. Like you don't know no. what you're gonna get, or you, you know, know what you know when you're okay. ordering what you're getting. Okay. Um, and I just think meal it's a genius pass? Meal, meal pal pal. Okay. I wonder if it's a thing here. 
I think they also, you could use your credits for workout classes. Like they're just oh, making it. So you buy the credits wow. like inexpensive. Like I think wow. when you break it down, it's probably like five bucks a meal or something. Like yeah. it's, and it's just so they're trying to make it so that there's like less food waste and that yeah, it's I love that. getting out there more. I'm also always like, what do I get for lunch? Like, okay, I'll take I a walk lunch. around the yeah, block. The like, what yeah. can I pick up? I'm like, I haven't ever been to this restaurant. Like I'll try it. I well, got especially a smoothie the other day. York. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, I yeah. eat my same shit because it's like, I like what I like, but I feel yeah. like if I yes. lived in New York, I would feel like so, many so much things. pressure to like mm-hmm. eat good. No, you're right. <laughs> yeah. You're right. You're not wrong. Yeah. And there's so many options, um, especially like living alone. I feel like you're always like, oh, I got to cook for one person. Like it kind of cuts out one meal, but mm-hmm. makes it cost effective. I just think it's genius. I'm like wondering how they're profiting here. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. I guess they are. The no modifications would get me. When I saw your post, I was like, oh, fuck. I'm such a like, no this, no that. Yeah. Like, I'm that person. But that is nice about like food waste because I'm sure they mm-hmm. change it daily because of like whatever ingredients or things they have more of, you know? And it's like, they have to really just throw it away. It. And they could just make mass quantities of that one thing. I yeah. think like it's like, yeah. oh, no, the sweet green bowl. Like, we'll like we got too many apples. Let's make yeah. a party. Yeah. 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 More people yeah. need to know about this. Um, my rack, I feel like mine's are always music related. Um, are you guys Spotify users? Mm-hmm. Spotify? Okay, cool. Yes. Just had to make sure. <laughs> um, so, uh, you know how like the past few years you get your like Spotify wrapped, like your top songs. Well, if you've been listening to Spotify long enough, like I have my Spotify 2016. And you know how when 2024 started, everyone's like, I feel like 2016 and 2024 have similar energies. Yeah. Did you come across Yes, that? that's right. So I've been in like 2016 mode. And as we've been like driving around LA, we're like, we feel yeah. like that it's era. We were coming a lot in 2016, 2017. I don't know. It's just like a thing for us. And so I've been listening to like my 2016 playlist, my 2017, and it really brings you back. Like for me, yeah, I'm, I'm sure so you guys nostalgic. too. I do that sometimes. So I highly suggest everyone go back and like see if, if you're listening to Spotify during that time, then it's they've got a playlist for you and it brings you back Wait, it's just like that. it makes you feel something yes yeah. like oh my gosh i remember listening to this song when i had a crush on this guy like, oh it's, my god it's really so fun it really i do that sometimes with my 20 2017 playlist oh see and i'll just be like oh my god i remember i was obsessed with like galantis at that time so i'll yes. play like betty oh. wop yes <laughs> literally <laughs> wop. fifth harmony will come on for me sometimes and it like yes. i'm brought right back to like 2015 it's crazy yeah music definitely is like the same thing as scent like with the memories yes. attached yeah. to it yeah uh, I feel the that. best. Wow, that was great. Thank you guys yeah. for sharing. You guys are regular gals on the go now. Yay! Yeah, yeah, you are inducted. Finally. Yeah, seriously. Okay, so in this day and age, well, you guys have been same thing as us, like doing social media for the longest time. I mean, you guys are crushing it, killer, so successful. I feel like you're also crushing it on TikTok reels, like short yes. form and everything too. Like, how does your brain keep so many tabs open? <laughs> like, you're like, you're doing our vlog. We're doing our like reels TikTok. Like, yeah, we're selfish. We started wanna... another podcast. Like, how? No, literally. I, 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 how, like, how are we doing it? Well, you guys, I know you have like an amazing team. And, like, yeah, we have and a stuff. lot of help. We have a lot of help. I can, <laughs> we all know what happens when I do everything by myself. I'd be burnt out. Like, <laughs> yeah, like, yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, I will say learning how my brain works and operates has been the biggest thing. Mm-hmm. I literally have ADHD. I can hyper-focus on anything. Everything else is out of sight, out of mind. Mm. So like, I can't, I, I've tried to film a main channel and vlog that day and film a t- one TikTok that day. I can't do that shit. I have to do like, okay, today I'm just focusing on this main channel video or like mm. today I'm just going to focus on, um, vlogging or if, or before, if I was still filming something for like the main channel, I would still vlog. But then I was like, you know, I'd rather just give my all to one. Mm-hmm. Like that's been the biggest thing. I think I, some people can do it. I don't know how they do it. I can't do it. Um, as far as like, short form and TikToks. I feel like there was just this era where, you know, a lot of people were telling YouTubers like, Hey, like get on this train. And I've, I always liked it, but like, it took me for years just to talk to my story. Like it would felt so weird to talk to my phone versus a camera. Like, I agree. Like it took me, I think I watched one of your vlogs when you were talking about, it. you're like, I'm trying to talk more. To, like, yes. I forget what it was. I was conditioned to like, I could not just be like, Hey guys, what's up? Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> I couldn't, mm-mm, couldn't would overthink everything. So, um, where was I even going with that? Just well, all the, the distinction you, of people like, were telling you to start doing TikTok. Oh yeah. yeah. So yeah. I always wanted to like get on board, but I just felt like I really struggled figuring out my thing, mm-hmm. yeah. I guess. Um, but one taking the pressure off of have to having a thing. That's my biggest. Yeah. I know niche makes you grow, but like I'm so for not being niche. Like I'm so that's for true, yeah. just, I, I'm very grateful. We're in like the lifestyle. We can do whatever we want, you know, umbrella. <laughs> you can evolve, you can grow more yeah, like yeah. personally and figure out things. Um, but I, I have a social media coordinator who like I, she helps me, um, film a lot of my TikToks or reels, 
And uh, mostly TikToks. And then if I like how I look enough, <laughs> I'll put it on my Wait, Instagram. Wait, why is it? <laughs> we're the same. Like, that no. can go on TikTok, uh, no problem. I'm like, I'll embarrass know. myself on TikTok. I'll say anything. I'll do anything. Like, but reels, I'm so like, that's nice. yes. public. <laughs> no, <laughs> even like our My our home podcast. friends will see that. Yeah. yeah it, it is. Something hits yeah, different. Even uh-huh. podcast clips. Podcast yeah. clips. Like, that's Instagram worthy. That is not. I know. Uh-huh. I care so much more like what my old, like people that I haven't even spoken to and never will see again from high school think of me. Than anybody that I don't know, like that I feel that too. Yeah, yeah, you're validated, Alicia. No, it felt like that. It's so, that's so real. Okay, good. It's so real. I'll never see them again, but like I know they're gonna see it. No, yeah. a thousand, a thousand percent. Um, so yeah, I definitely have help. She's amazing. Um, she'll edit them. I Will think she that's helped the with thing. like trending sounds, too. ideas. Yeah, I think okay. um she'll, she'll come oh, up with a lot good. of ideas. But again, I'm I if I don't feel somewhat like passionate about it it just comes off so disingenuous yeah. and then it's like alicia you clearly don't care about that nail polish why are you talking about it you oh, know what i mean definitely. or whatever the case is so we have a running like shared note on my phone um of just ideas that she'll add i'll add and then i'll just checklist um the, or like check mark the ones that i like oh, cool. um or if i write one that are okay for filming whether mm. i put it in or she put it in and then that way when we come to like um, when she comes out, she'll come to my house and we'll just like film and like, wow. just like a TikTok um, day or yeah. short form day. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um, it's turned into less of like just short form days, but there'll definitely be a like, Oh, another thing that helped me so much is I'll do a lot while I'm getting ready. Cause no matter what I have to get ready, even if I'm filming a main wow. channel video. So that's kind of changed more recently. So I feel like it's less like Monday, this Tuesday, this, and no, ma- I can film like five when I'm getting ready. Yes. Some and hair, then, yeah. Face, oh like- my God. And I can talk about a story while I'm doing my hair mm-hmm. and no matter what, I still need to be ready. So by the end I'm ready and then I can film a fashion one and then I can still yeah. do whatever, have a go to that meeting or do whatever thing like that. So getting, doing TikToks while getting ready has been habit stuff. Everything. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. Do you have a frequency of po- both of you? Do you have a frequency of posting that you like to hit on everything? Well, obviously if your podcast once a week, then the new podcast <laughs> vlogs and everything are, is, are they just sporadic or are you guys like, we like to post two a week? Like what? Um, I'm aiming for like three to four vlogs a week and then <gasps> one main channel video every like two to three weeks but sometimes i'll go like a month in between just because i have i feel like i really want to i want to love whatever i put on that channel 100 percent. and then tiktoks we're trying to do every day for the most part Mm -hmm. and i think that's it but again we have help editing we have help yes yes, um, yes. so much help vlog editor i'll still touch my main channel a little bit but i would love to still find someone who can like We've been trying to like test different people to see, oh, cool. um, to fully hand that off, but I struggle with it so much because yeah. I'm, I either struggle because I'm like, I, I can just do this myself and I can save money or I'm like, damn, like that's so expensive. Like someone's rate. And I'm like, I can just do it. But then I'm like, I but know. Alicia, you're like, if you want someone good, you're going to have mm-hmm. to pay what like they, they, they deserve to be paid, mm-hmm. you know? So then I'm like, no, no, I can do it. It's just like a room doer or, oh, it's just like, I don't yes. know. So I struggle with that a lot. We're so different. Ah! I'm just kidding. kidding. No, I have, um, I'm very, I'm super type A, super organized. So for me, I like to compartmentalize my week where Monday for me is like, if we have like meetings or like a catch up, I'll do a team catch up on Monday go through everything with that. Um, I get, in, like, I get any brand stuff done and then do long form on Mondays, Tuesdays are podcast days always. And now with the new pod, it's ever changing between PB and PXU. Wednesdays are my short form days. So we'll just, Ollie, who's my social media manager, will we'll have like a conversation beforehand of like how much can you handle today? Like one original recipe, let's do, cause I do so much food content. Right. It's really easy to like fit that stuff in and it's fun. Yeah, I will usually feel sick by the end of the day though. Yeah. After doing like seven fa- taste tests, but <laughs> we'll like figure it out. We've, we've like worked through finding a cadence of like how much mm-hmm. is too much and how much is not mm-hmm. enough. Um, and then I'll, yeah, I'll have them come over and everything's already pretty much like ready to go. And I also like, again, I'm very, organized so i have them make it like to a t like a schedule of like okay we're gonna oh. arrive at 10 from 10 to 10 30 we're gonna like talk about this and then from 10 30 to 11 we're gonna film taste test one 11 to 12 we'll like take a lunch break 12 to 12 30 we're doing this so it's like very i could see everything in front of me um and then thursday and fridays are usually days of catching up other things um or like any other appointments and things that i couldn't do the first three days um and then i vlog usually i vlog I'd say like probably six days out of the week, six to seven days, honestly, Amazing. like little bits and bobs throughout yeah. the day. Um, but yeah, having that structure is what keeps me sane. Yeah. Cause I cannot go off of that. Or well, I'll Cause then, mind. yeah, that's, I should do that because then I don't feel bad, especially when you have people that you're working with as well. It's so easy to just like talk about whatever. It's like, okay, we got to stick to the schedule because it helps everyone involved. For sure. Cause you want to just talk the whole time. Yeah. But like, so let's- different. So I know Laura's here, like overhearing. All- Laura's my assistant. Uh-huh. I couldn't live without her. Like literally, my schedule. If like, 
like today I was like, okay, I have pretty basic. <laughs> like I don't even know what tomorrow is and I'll look at that tonight. But um, I like, I feel hard on myself. If I get off schedule, I'll be like, I'll be more frustrated that way. No, so you know I yourself. like being more vague, but that's so, like, I, but, and then also I think it's, what's also really hard is we've both figured out things that work for us. Mm -hmm. However, there's still days where literally yesterday I had more of a filming day. Uh, another filming day and I was tapped out I was like dude my period starting any minute mm. I've been up the past few nights like really late when I shouldn't have been um I yeah. like I was just off so everyone went home early and I was like I'm so sorry but because it has to be genuine and there, yes. I know there's days for you too yeah, like yeah and that's the thing that's hard when you're trying to juggle everything you can't be a machine because that's no. why that's not why social media became social media like yeah no one fun. wants to see you do something you don't want to do like that's painful to watch oh, you yeah. know sure. more often than not we'll have a full Wednesday scheduled and then after making it through like three or four, I'm like, I'm good now. We'll just, and then he'll be yeah. like, okay, let's push this one to the top of next week then. And like, it's like, what really changing. matters? You for know? sure. For sure. And I think being willing to uh, even evolve the content being like, okay, like, do you enjoy this? Like, mm -hmm. cause God forbid you're like doing 12 recipes and you're like, I'm not having fun. Like yeah. granted it's still work, but I think that's one thing as a creative, you have to realize this is a creative job and you have to fulfill that creative side to you. Like you want to be like, like, like we we're all so blessed. And so, like the fact that we're, we're able to do this as our job, like so I cool. always want to think of like our younger selves who first started. And it's like, like we may like, we're here and we're still mm -hmm. doing this. Like, like let, like be proud of yourself. Be excited. Yes. Like this is like, the dream for so many people and it was like it was for when you first started mm -hmm. like you're here like don't put yourself through hell just trying to like upload a tiktok you know what i mean yeah. or whatever or keep up with trends or i don't know mm -hmm. yeah like do it when it feels right that's how we were always like okay that's trending but like i don't have anything to do for it you know like oh, yeah. i want to yeah. have fun with it for sure yeah i feel like a lot of times we can get so swept up in the trends, especially with something like TikTok blowing up yep. as like for the longest time. I remember, yeah, so many people on our teams or just the public would be like, oh, my God, like you should get on TikTok. You should, uh -huh. should do this, do that. And I fought it for so long because I every time I try, I'd be like, hi, guys, did it like it as if it was a YouTube weird. video. Which, yeah. I mean, to still some degree I do because it's all I know. But it's ingrained. It, exactly. It took a long time for me to be like, OK, maybe I can't do a TikTok. Like I'm friends with Kirsten Titus. And when I mm. first when she first started making content, she was like, post five times a day. I was like, well, I can't I do like, that. Because nope. she'll just like set up the camera and be like, la, 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 la. and like it's and it's so good. Yeah. And yeah. I'm like, I have to like sit there and think about everything that I'm like going to say uh -huh. before. And like, I can't just fly off the cuff like she, that. She is perfect for that. Yeah. Um. So I think it's just like trying to go with the trends but like adapting them to something that feels right to i can you. still do exactly and will not make me go crazy yeah and being aware of like to kirsten that's so easy like to her she's like yeah why wouldn't i do that but also you have to keep in mind if we just hopped from platform to platform to platform like you can't neglect no the, longevity the yeah like it's okay to also be like there's a lane for that yes and people will succeed in that but i can also stay in this lane like i, I don't have that. to do every single thing um and it also, there's that give and take though of like, okay, but at what point do you evolve with the times mm -hmm. and like let go of something that isn't necessarily serving you anymore or working? So true. Um, but also I feel like there's so many YouTubers who like kind of quit and like went to short form and now it's like, oh, YouTube's coming back. So it's like yeah. everyone's wanting to post you YouTube and you're off the channel. And yeah. also I'm sure same thing with you guys, even like on that Revolve trip that we went on, like so all those girls were Instagram girls. And yeah. when they found out we were YouTube girls, they're like, how do you do it? Like it's always that same with TikTok. It's always how do you do YouTube? And I feel like sorry, lost my train of thought. What were you talking about? No, no, no. Just like when do you let go of something that's not working versus like following and hopping to platform to platform? And lost now that YouTube's my, yeah, coming back, lost well, you YouTube's to, just stuck fun. around. That's what it is. Yeah. YouTube's YouTube, always yeah. been there. And I feel like yeah, people always say like, how do you make videos that long? I'm like, how do you make videos that short? Like, yeah. how do you get all your so thoughts much to say? So, so like, thank God say. TikTok's up to ten minutes now. Yeah. Oh my for us YouTube girls, truly. <laughs> really, like, when they changed it. that, when, like YouTube Shorts still only being a minute, I'm like, please, I have uh -huh. so much more I need I to know. say. I literally <laughs> said that to a YouTube girl the other day. She's Me like, too. but I think it's hard for them because YouTube is long form, so they have to have some short form. Yeah. Like, then yeah. it's just another little mini YouTube video. I see for where sure. they're going. Yeah. But I know. I think it's coming. I think yeah, yeah, yeah. I hope so. Longer. Every yeah. time I'm like, please, just like Same. three minutes. I'll take three. I'll yeah. take a minute and a half. A minute Anything. And a half. Yeah. 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 Anything. Yeah. Anything. That's what and Reels and did, right? Yeah. Reels, yeah, Reels well, Reels now, you know, you can do as long as you want. Yeah. I didn't realize that. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. But you have to post it like post it as a post. As a, yeah, as a post. Oh, but it, it goes in yep. reels. Like it still goes in the feed. So I'll I just take think. whatever I can get. Yeah. It's hard because they say to grow, you have to be on TikTok and Reels and all these places. So it's like, okay, 
I'm still gonna do my vlogs, but like mm-hmm. if I want to grow, I gotta post over here. Like, uh, yeah, that's it's where so I get caught in the like the loop. I think. I of, think what I also that. what we both try to do at times is like, okay, what is our long term goal? Like, I remember Rem being like, I I want to do cooking. So then suddenly it was like, well, what aligns with that and what doesn't? Like, mm. I can't be doing like comedy sketches. <laughs> And like going down that lane so strong if this is what I really want to do. You know what I mean? So like true. I feel like a lot of fashion girls struggle with that because fashion's so niche. Mm-hmm. But it's like, oh, I only got like 20,000 views on that. I'm like, bitch, that's still 20,000 fucking views. But obviously compared to Mr. Beast, it's different. Like you can't compare mm-hmm. that. Mm-hmm. Um, no, but but if you have that passion of like, no, this is what I want to do. Like, I don't know. Those people, I don't know. I remember no. what I was going to say. I post a TikTok. I try to post a TikTok every day. And like, a, if I wasn't doing everything else, I feel like I'd be a certified TikToker. Same. Mm-hmm. To me, I love the podcast, obviously, but I, and I do consider myself a podcaster. Down deep in my core, I'm a YouTuber. Us like, too. that's yeah. just what it is. And I feel like I enjoy doing short form. And now I like it because I did fight it for so long. I was like, I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. Now I genuinely enjoy doing it's so it. It's exciting. It's so much fun. And it's such a, it's a new, platform that I'm learning all about and I'll make a TikTok and then I will put that on reels because it's easy not having like be my personal Instagram put it on reels I'll also put it on shorts so I'll put it all over because I'm not going to do three different videos no. For three different audiences. Yeah. Like it's, yeah. There's overlap, but there's some people who are not on TikTok mm-hmm. or not it on shorts, true. whatever yep. it is. Um, but ultimately my bread and butter and like my soul is all on YouTube. So I really try to focus all almost all my energy on that. Just because, mm-hmm. like, it's what also makes me the happiest. Yeah. And I have, like, my strongest community there. Mm-hmm. I know. That's the thing. That's also, where they know your middle name. Right? Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. They I know, like, all about my dog. Yeah. And, like, my life, my yeah. family. Also, that's the, th- the thing about being in the lifestyle category is, like, in the end, people are attracted to you for your personality more than anything. Yeah. And it's, like, I, I understand, again, how, like, the niche thing, like, grows you so well. But I think the one reason we've been able to do this for so long is because it we mm-hmm. aren't just known as, like, oh, that's the... the Girl who does her makeup girl crazy. Girl who does blank. Yeah. Or, like, oh, that's the candle making something. Or that's <laughs> the da-da-da. Like, Meredith Duxbury's done a great job of being that girl. The girl who does the crazy foundation and has evolved from that. And not She's many like people can do that. fashion girl now. Yeah, but, like, it just shows how... Not many people like make it past it's that, but you have to like evolve and like change. But my favorite thing about not being niche is that we have, you know, people who followed us for so many different things and different um, reasons. But like in yeah. the end, it, it really is who you are and your personality. So it's like mm-hmm. um, I've had so many, I'm sure you guys too, so many talks with like TikTokers who are like, how, like we said, how do you do YouTube? Yeah. Like, <laughs> like, how do you get people to like, p- they really to struggle convert. getting that conversion of people leaving tiktok for that and i'm like i'm so grateful we just started when we did like even the podcast like yeah oh totally it's insane i don't know if i would like start a brand new podcast this year yeah we i mean we did oh (laughs) oh, i don't count that not me either those are two podcasts podcasts that are are, no no, no, i don't think that at all it's so overly saturated now i don't think i would either honestly i think it would just be it'd be a lot harder to get a new audience yeah you're not gonna leave me for the Danielle Carolyn show? No, like <laughs> never. Danielle Carolyn Daily. I, <laughs> I give props to people who have like a podcast just on their own. Like, don't you guys love having each other? Oh my yeah. god, yeah. To banter. I the one I time I did a solo episode because I think like you were sick or something. I spent three hours recording, profusely sweat. I sweat through the couch. <laughs> yeah, you're like, <laughs> we edited it down. It was thirty minutes. Oh my god, yeah. thirty minutes. It's hard to talk. It's weird because we do YouTube videos. But, like, for some reason, talking and sitting in one so chair. But a sit-down talking video and your yeah. feelings and, like... It's chopped up. It's so when nice I do to feed off of each yeah. other. For sure. Yeah. For sure. Yeah. Like, if wow. you're doing a Q&A or something, like, it's not... I love a Q&A. 40 minute stream <laughs> yeah. of consciousness. Yeah. Like, it's like, okay, now I gotta find the next question. Yep. Yeah. 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 You're going through it. Um, okay. Well, I mean, we've been talking for a no, long, I, really long yeah, time. I know. So I think we have to wrap it up, yeah. probably. Wrap it up in a little bow. Um... I'm sure that everybody follows you. I can't believe, I wouldn't, I can't imagine that anybody who's listening to this no, does this it. this is but so it, exciting. They're so excited. Yes. But shout yourselves out. Oh, okay. I'm Miss <laughs> Remy Ashton on um, TikTok, Instagram, YouTube, Ram Life on YouTube, and hey. then Cooking with Remy and Pretty Basic and Pretty X Unfiltered. Woo. Uh, hi, I'm Alicia. Um, my handles are Alicia on Instagram and then Alicia Marie everywhere else. Obviously, Second half to Pretty Basic, mm. a fourth of Pretty X Unfiltered. Um, and yeah, YouTube, Alicia Marie. 
And Alicia Marie vlogs. They have the best Alicia vlogs. Marie vlogs. <laughs> you guys crush it. I can't. I couldn't imagine if you didn't watch. Like, I feel like these. You know, they're so. Do you, how good. do you guys feel about the comments that they're like? You were you raised me. Like, are you offended by that? Are you like, like over it? it? I love it. You like oh, it. Really? I love it. Okay. Like, I truly am like. You stayed. <laughs> yeah, no, literally, you stuck what? around. I will say some of my favorite comments um, are. Oh my god! I unsubscribed forever ago, but I came back. Like, like, That's and I'm like, oh, I did it. Like, you earned that. Like, oh, yeah. I used to watch you. Wait, I'm back. Yeah, like, yes, yeah. because I'm like, that's all I feel like I've ever been trying. So that I feel like that must world. happen a lot with people unsubscribing from YouTube and finding you on TikTok yeah. now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Probably really popular. No, Do people ever say really that fun? in person. Like, oh, I used to watch you. I'm oh yeah, like, I had that yesterday. Yeah, yeah. yeah. but I'm not offended at all because I like maybe they don't watch YouTube anymore. I feel like I was. Even if they don't, I'm like, that's fine. Thanks for watching for a minute. Like. Uh, when it first happened, maybe like four years ago, mm-hmm. I remember being like, oh, wait, so you don't watch anymore? And like, it's sad about it. Yeah. But now I feel like I'm like, no, that's like, thank you. Like, oh yeah. my God. Like, especially when I think of like, like I grew up with Liz McGuire. I'm like, oh my God. Like, Hannah Montana, like, like I grew up that that's the whole mm-hmm. thing that like no one else can take away. You know, the yeah. yeah. The nostalgicness. Oh my God. And life gets busy and like, maybe they're not watching YouTube anymore. Yeah. Or, like whatever. Yeah. And if they're not, if they are still, that's okay too. Like mm-hmm. it's an honor. Also they way. graduated forever ago. Yeah. They don't need like, back oh, to school. Yeah. They don't need it. They don't have a locker. They don't, they don't need have what's a in my backpack. Anyway. Like, <laughs> you, I, I go through phases with watching people too. Oh yeah. Like, you know, you're sure. heavy on watching them and you kind of get, like, yeah, you, you get fixation. Exactly. So it's understandable. This was so fun. I'm so glad we got to love it. I feel like I was like transported. Like I don't yes. want to like take the headphones off. I know, I know. It's like a bubble. I know it's Wait, true. The stars behind you guys have been like tripping me out in the best way. Yeah, I, I realized they're like, in space. <laughs> it's so cool. We're in a spaceship. It's like the Rolls Royce. What it, yes. is that what it is? I know yeah. when the guy was like, "We could do this for like like a Rolls Royce." <laughs> they oh, barely show. It. Hopefully, they show on camera. I, I'm serious. Half the set doesn't show. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, we love it. So we love you guys so much. Thanks so much for watching and listening, and we'll see you next week. Bye. Bye. Bye.